guys, it is Briar Trout here and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. So I got an unexpected package in the mail. I never really bothered to check if they shipped my special runs or not. So welcome to my Briar Fest haul. Uh, they just got here today. I'm not sure if both are in here. It seems, I guess they could both fit in here technically. Yeah, my Briar Fest haul was the smallest it's ever been with a total of well, technically four horses. Well, five actually. Oh god, five with the um, celebration. So you know what? Let's let's start off my full haul. Well, I know it's not my traditional um, haul videos where I lay them all out on my bed and show you guys, but there's only so many models. So let's first start off with my uh, celebration model. Absolutely obsessed with him. I honestly think that he's my favorite celebration celebration model ever. Uh, he just has such nice shading and I really love this mold and it's simple but they did a really good job with it and I am super happy that I own him. That is model number one. Now let's unbox the rest of my haul. So as I said, I just pretty much got my special runs as well as glossy cheesecake. So he will not be here until December. So we got a while to wait for that. But I do got these guys now, so that's exciting. I'm thinking, oh, if you guys don't know, the, the special run is out, obviously. I'm sure you guys seen it by now. I won't say what it is just because in case people want it to be a surprise, I understand that, but you literally have to stay off the internet if you don't want to know what it is. <clears throat> but there is three variations that I really like, two specifically. Um, and the glossies. I always want a glossy, but I think I, I'm like actively on the hunt for a matte version just because I really can't drop a ton of money on a glossy right now as much as I want to. Um, but I really love the mold. It was the one mold I didn't want it to be because I love it that much, but of course it was. So, um, yeah, that's, that's exciting. And I also did um, on Model Horse Auction Facebook page, I placed a bid on a jersey, which is one of the stable mates. I think he's my favorite. Honestly, I think I like him more than the Cory Damsha. I just, that mold, that stable mate mold is probably my favorite stable mate mold. I don't know why, I think it's so adorable. But hopefully I will be um, getting him so we can add on to the haul. <gasps> Both horses are in here. Okay, so we're gonna start off with, mm, I don't know, the ponies are a Pona. I kinda wanna start off with the Pona, just because she's kind of a surprise, because if you guys don't know, half of the, or I don't know the split exactly, but I think it's, yeah, split 50-50, um, loose mane and braided. And I really like the loose mane version, so I'm really hoping that it's the loose mane version. I honestly don't wanna go through the hassle of trading for a loose mane. It's not so easy now that it's on a person. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna deal with whatever I have more than likely. Oh, I got the braided version. Okay, but well, let's see. She's still, she's still really pretty. Okay, oh my God. Wow, it looks like I, so far, it looks like I got a really nice one. Let's unwrap her little head oh and her tail you know honestly I don't hate the braids as much as I thought I would it kind of it kind of suits this mold well I do have uh, sugar or old iron sides and she is loose mane but honestly I kind of like this variation I'm usually a loose mane person all the way but I really don't mind this so just a quick glance over her. She does have some dapples. Um, there is a hair in her paint, so that's not very fun. Um, but honestly, her, her markings look pretty crisp. Yeah, there's another hair. What the heck? Okay, like it's not the most noticeable, but there's three hairs on her. Like in the paint. Oh, okay, well that's a little not fun. But, um, I mean, at least her markings are pretty crisp. That's a nice, at least. I mean, it's not anything enough to send her back. Uh, I don't think you even can this year, um, unless they're, like, literally broken. But, yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm happy with her. I, I'm not sure if I was even going to show her anyway. But I might try and fix her up a little bit. She does have a few little shinies. 
and like some marks in her white but uh overall really really nice horse i'm really happy with her okay and now for my absolute favorite thing that i wanted this briar fest thank god i got them or this whole briar fest just would have been a total bust but ooh. okay who do i open first the mom or the baby okay i think i'm gonna start with ah! okay i'm gonna start with the baby baby okay I haven't, I've never like even held this mold in person before. I should probably figure out what their actual names are too. I've like, I've just been referring to them as Pony. So Bridget or Brit, yeah, Bridget and Beltani. So this is Beltani, the little pony. Oh my gosh, so cute. Oh my gosh. This, this is the most adorable thing in the world. Oh my gosh. This is literally my favorite variation on the mold as of now, except for the raffle, obviously, but I like these more than the original. Like, he is just so cute. Oh my, look at his little baby face. Ah, oh, I'm so happy with him. Okay, put him down and get mom out. Oh, I can already tell she's pretty. Oh wow, I love her color. Oh my gosh. Whoa, her color is so nice. I did not realize how nice their coloring was. Wow, I love this mold. This is too cute. Oh my gosh. I love her. That's so cute. Okay, so I guess I should look them over for some flaws. Some of her markings are not the crispest, but still overall pretty decently nice. There's some overspray on her mane um, and some shinies, which are easy to get rid of, so I don't really care about that. And no. Yeah, she looks overall pretty good for me. So these were my favorite social runs this year, so I'm very excited about them. Okay, hi again. So I have some very exciting news about these two, but more specifically, this girl right here. So I'm going to show you a picture of Briar. Sorry, my hands are all dirty. I was just in the barn. Um, I'm going to show you a picture of Briar's promotion pictures for her. And now look at her. So I think I have a variation or people are telling me that it's like flipped. So they like flipped the markings. So where this whole big patch is supposed to be on this side. I don't know. I don't know if I believe that. That might be it. I haven't seen the other side of the promotion pictures, but oh my gosh, I might have a variation or a mistake on Briar's part, but still super cool and makes me love her even more. I knew there was a reason I liked her more than I did in the promo pictures. Her coloring definitely looks better in person, but also like there's more of the color to love. And I'm so excited, but yeah, that's just my little tidbit. Um, but yeah, back to the video. And I'll make sure to keep you guys updated on my Instagram if I see anything else. As of now, I think the full is the same as um, it is supposed to be. But yeah, pretty, pretty girl. I'm so excited. Also, another quick add-on. Um, I will be keeping her, at least as of now. I have absolutely no plans of selling her. Last year, I got super duper lucky and got a rare horse and had to sell her. I didn't have to, but it was just financially responsible for me so I could pay for riding for school but um I have no reason to sell her right now I have a good paying job so I'm definitely going to be holding on to her I was so excited to get her from the beginning of Briar Fest so no way I'm letting this girl go anytime uh, but yeah she is so cute and I can't get over how adorable they they're just so cute like they're ponies and they're just adorable that's that's my haul guys like I know it's it's like nothing. Like I feel so weird ending it right now, but like this is it. Oh wow, it's so weird. I usually have like at least 15 horses that I'm bringing home every year, but hopefully that will be next year's. Oh my gosh, I don't even know where I'm gonna put her on my shelf, but she's so pretty and I love this full. I think this is my new favorite Marin full set that I own. 
Just saying. All right, guys. Well, I hope that you enjoyed my haul. Look out in December for my video of cheesecake. Uh, unboxing him, glossy cheesecake. Very excited about that. Um, and hopefully I'll be getting a uh, jersey soon if I win that little auction and maybe even a surprise. I'll probably do an unboxing on my channel if it is a surprise horse. Um, but if not, if it's just jersey, I'll post it on my Instagram and probably video me unboxing him there. So yeah, guys, I hope that you enjoyed. Make sure to go check out my experience video. It's a short little funny video. And then I'm going to be posting my little vlog soon, maybe even before this. We'll see what I end up editing first. All right, guys, I hope you guys had a great breakfast and are getting all the ponies that you really wanted. And make sure to follow me on Instagram at XRRTron. And most importantly, stay fabulous. Bye.